side. Um, as you can see, I've got this camera stuck here. I got a feeling this is going to wiggle around so much that the video from it will be useless. Plus, it'll probably fall off and I'll lose my GoPro. But, um, I thought I'd give it a try. What the heck? It's a cool day today. This says 63 degrees. Let's, let's give it a whirl. See what happens. That's kind of nice. I can actually see it in my rearview mirror there. So, yeah, I've got to run an errand. I am out of vape juice. And hopefully my local vape shop considers nicotine to be a vital service that must remain open. But we'll see about that. It's definitely a chilly day with rain coming later. Let's, let's give this a try. that if I don't gear all the way down to first gear as I come to a stop, if I just go to neutral, then when I want to get going, I have a hard time finding first gear. And it's it's funny, my, my Honda does the exact same thing, my CB500X. Um, and I've been told that's common, but it's funny, in all the motorcycles I've ever had before, I've never, I've never seen this problem before. So it's... Uh, kind of suspect to say the least but if I do gear all the way down to first come to a complete stop and then go up to neutral then when I want to get going again I can click down to the first without a problem so it's weird it just makes an enormous difference on these cool days to have some passive I mean some active heat otherwise what heat you have just slowly bleeds out of your body or at least mine and I just get colder and colder and colder on a ride like this Social distance is right here on a bike. 